Hi there. Can you hear me yet, Crystal? Hello. Hi, everyone. Welcome to the Monica S. Martinez live TV show. Mm -hmm. We actually have a guest on. Um, oh, Crystal, can you hear me? Can you hear me, Crystal? Hey, beautiful. You've got a text message. Can you hear me, Crystal? Hello? Okay. So I'm not sure what's going on. Uh, we have Crystal on, on with us tonight. So again, I just wanna say thank you for everyone coming week after week to join me here on Monica S. Martinez Live where we go live once a week and we educate you. And I just want to make sure I'm in camera's view. Crystal, can you hear me yet? Okay, so we're experiencing technical difficulties, but be live. That's great. Well, anyway, I'm just going to go ahead and roll with these, with what we got going on, and we're going to figure out why she can't hear me. So I am Monica S. Martinez. I am an author. I am the voice for the sexually repressed. I am a poet. I am the CEO of Tantalizing Productions. Feel free to visit me on any of my sites. Um, Monica S. Martinez on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and uh, MonicaSMartinez.com as well. And definitely check out tantalizingproductions.com. Um, first and foremost, you know, week after week, we have to thank our sponsors, so to speak. And our first sponsor we want to thank is Mini Moments, who sent out a bunch of wonderful creams to me. Um, the Body Shea Butter, which I told you guys I used it and it's gone completely um her lavender oil i use i rub it on my pillow so that i can get some sleep and for those of you who are logged on to youtube um definitely come over to facebook i mean i have the youtube running as well if you guys want to check me out on that side because i think that on youtube you get to see more of me so to speak. Crystal, can you hear me yet? And there's no response. So I'm assuming she can't hear me. Um, Dillis, can you let me know whether or not you can hear me or you guys online? Can you let me know that you're hearing me nice, loud and clear? So I'm um, not, let's see. Hmm. Uh, and then she's going to refresh again. All right. Let's see. Um, Crystal, can you hear us yet? All right. So I'm assuming she can't hear because she's not responding to me. Um, anyway, if it's not YouTube, it's Facebook. And week after week, we're dealing with it. And Yes, I am stressing. Can you see it in my face? So annoying. Uh, Crystal, can you hear me, Crystal? All right, so I guess Crystal can't hear me, but all right, whatever. We're just going to go ahead and see if we're doing this correctly. Let me just copy this link. Well, I know that you guys are, some guys are on. You guys are on because I see that we have viewers. And I also, like I've mentioned, I am on, I'm also on um, YouTube posting live. So back to what I was saying. Um, 
Okay, I just got a text saying someone hears me, so it's we're not sure what the deal is on that end there with Crystal. So hopefully we'll find out. Oh my God. Let's see what's going on. I don't know. Anyway. All right, Dillis is inviting folks. Great, thank you. Back to what I was saying. We want to thank Mini Moments for being a sponsor of the Monica S. Martinez Live TV. So visit her at minimoments.com and you know hey. join her. Hi, can you hear me? Crystal? Because mm -hmm. I hear you. Hello, Still Crystal, you. can you hear me? Oh, it's so aggravating guys, I'm telling you. Um, anyway, back to what I was saying. Another uh, sponsor that we wanna thank is gna.com for these amazing headsets here. Hey. And of course, my favorite color because those are the color of my logo. So we want to thank GNA.com. Visit his Facebook page, GNA, and um, check out the headsets. They're awesome. They are gaming headphones, but I use them for Skype. I use them to chat on my phone. The noise uh, reduction sound is totally amazing. So GNA. Dot com. So we want to thank you guys for being a part of the Monica S. Martinez TV live. So guys, we had an event um, last week at Casa Lounge for Erotic Rendezvous. If you missed it, it sucks to be you because it was an awesome event. And we want to thank all those who came out, The Essence, for hosting the event for us. Thank you. And on June 29th, Tantalizing Productions will be in Brooklyn. Check out my Facebook for that invite. So June 29th, Brooklyn from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Check us out. So if you are watching from YouTube, yay, hi. And, um, you know, definitely move over to Facebook so that you can hear the interview. Otherwise, you'll just be hearing one side or maybe you will hear. Her. I'm not sure how it works, but so I know I got viewers on YouTube and I got viewers here on the live. All right. So we invited Crystal back. Um, she was on our first show. And she hosts. She is the owner of Curvy Girl. Can you hear me yet? You can hear me. Okay, but I still can't hear you, Crystal. So, oh, hi. Oh, yes, Evelyn, no, I won't let it stress me. Okay, all the comments are coming in slowly and I'm sorry. And guys, I have got to, you know, pay attention to my interview and not let the ADD kick in over here on this side where I'm like looking for the uh, comments. Hi, Alan. Hi, Evelyn. Hi, Jackie. Mm -hmm. So as soon as Crystal gets it together, we will jump on an interview with her again. And like I said, she was here for our first uh, showcase. Uh, she and uh, move the hair out of your face, Malini says. I'm sorry, but you know, that's my signature boo. Um, so she was here for our first launch of the Monica S. Martinez TV, and she has a um, lingerie for curvy women, you know, the big girls. And as she still can't hear me, because I mean, I still can't hear her. And she's just amazing, and her energy is just great. So as soon as we can get her to talk, that would be good. Dillis, maybe have her join me on YouTube at this point. Um, I can give you the link for the YouTube because we have viewers over there as well. So let me um, let me look up that link. Guys, if you wanna, let me see. 
All right, let's see if we could get her on YouTube first before I'm talking all this crap. And then that's not even going to be the case. So hold on, guys. Uh, let's see. Okay. Let's get this in here. My name is messaging me. Hold on. Crystal, can you hear me, Crystal? Um, let's see if we can get her right there. Um, I'm not sure what's going on. I don't know if it's be, be live or if it's it's just my connection. Who knows at this point? Whatever. I'm so over YouTube. I'm so over be live because this is just getting ridiculous. Anyway, as you guys know, Tantalizing Productions hosts this. We have we host adult novelty parties where we come, we educate you on how to keep the spice in your relationship, how to keep the spice in your bedroom. We also now offer you guys as clients the Happy Cummings package. It's called the Tri-Monthly Package, where you get, you get a box quarterly, and in that box there are adult novelties to help you spice up your relationship. And I know Imalia told me I shouldn't drink when I am on TV or doing the live video, but honestly, I have to because it's hot. Can you hear me, Crystal? Can you hear me? Oh, yes, we can hear you. Okay. You still sound the same. I can hear you. Oh, Malami says there's something on her end. So you were having technical difficulties and technically it wasn't me. All right. Because I was just about to be over, be live and YouTube all together. Yes. Hi, Yvonne. Oh, thank you. I um I washed my hair. <laughs> so is your connection not good? Dilla, she's on. Oh, um, Evelyn says she can't hear you. Well, I can hear you. I can hear you, so well, you just disagree. Okay. Yeah. Um you're you just disappeared from my computer. Like I don't see you live anymore. Are you on Google Hangouts? Hold on, let me see. Let me see. Oh, there you go. So you're on YouTube. Okay. So, all right. So you took out, you took yourself out of live. All right, live. With okay. Um. All right. So I'm not sure how this is gonna work when we're. On. All right. Let me see. Guys on live. What do I do, Dillis? Do I send everyone back over to? Viewers can't hear her. I know, Emalia, we're having difficulties. Guys, can I ask that you come over to YouTube as well? Um, Google Hangouts, Monica S. Martinez Live TV. You can join us there. We'll be here on Facebook as well. I'm gonna keep both events going at this point. So, Crystal. Yes. It's a pleasure to have you back here joining us. Uh, you can do that. Okay, just sent her the link. Let me know if she logs on. You can do that. Um, okay, so guys, 
I got Crystal on YouTube, uh, Google Hangout. So if you want to check her out there, come visit us there. I'm going to keep the live video going here on Facebook. No, no, I'm not logging out of Facebook um, Live, Dallas. So if you want to send the link to the YouTube, we can do that as well. But I'm just going to keep everything opened at this point because YouTube is weird too. So I don't, you know, I'm, I'm getting, I'm, I think I'm over these two things, people. No, it's not your fault. I mean, it's if it's not one thing, it's another, and it's like driving me literally insane like i gotta be on youtube i'm on facebook it's crazy but before i get to you um and your beautiful self i'm just really excited about having you back on so i want to say thank you for joining us again it, it, it's just your energy was amazing so i was like we have to have like a full hour of her so a lot of the women went crazy about you and everything about what you were saying as far as you know the big girls the lingerie the toys so thank you thank you for joining us again so if you will if you don't mind if you could tell our viewers um who you are what you do and your movement pretty please Absolutely. I have. Sexy is a state of mind, not a, a size. Well, I just think that sex is good just in general. Um, I never want to say that it was wasted in my 20s because, well, maybe it was actually. Maybe it was. If, if I have to think about it, you're probably right. I didn't, I didn't experience an orgasm until I was in my 30s. So, yeah, I think that you are correct on that, that it is wasted on, um, you know, the 20s and that it does get enjoyable when we become older so <laughs> well, um, I, you know what? I don't, I don't, I don't want to talk about that right now because I don't want to be a Debbie Downer um, about my, yeah, about my first, um, you know, marriage and stuff like that. Um, yeah, so it, you know, sex wasn't supposed to be pleasurable, you know, for me, um, but. Being that I became sexually liberated in my 30s and, you know, it was a different, yeah, it was a different um, state of mind at that point for me where I was able to enjoy it. And once you have your safe zone, you're able to let loose, so to speak, and just kind of enjoy all the pleasure that comes with it. So, yeah, my very first... Oh no, it was, it was with my husband at the time, yeah. So, um, um, I've been educating since I am, what, 32, and I'm 48. <laughs> okay. 
Nice. Yeah. I mean, I think that it, it, it just, it, it's good. I promised to be the voice for the sexually repressed and that says, you know, Hey, I can, I can, you know, say the things that women think, but are still scared to say in a sense because they feel, you know, sex is still a taboo, unfortunately. Unfortunately. Yeah. I know. Can you imagine that? Our parents had sex. <laughs> That's how it happens. Yeah, I think that, um, you know, we were conditioned to just be you know, like, hey, sex is the only, the only time you talk about sex is like in your bedroom or you don't talk about it at all, which is crazy because we should talk about it. We should be educating these women on how to achieve the best orgasm there is, you know, whether, whether we're big, whether we're small, whatever, you know, um, I think that if, if people talk more about it and the more open we become, the better of an understanding we can have, you know? So, <laughs> you you know yeah but even even in the bible they were having sex so like exactly so i'm not sure you know why people get so uptight when when the subject is brought up it, it, it just drives me insane. But I mean, that's nor here or there. Absolutely. I mean, um, yeah, that whole misconception of those things is it, it boggles my mind. But that's for a whole nother show um, when, when we're talking about, you know, keeping them satisfied and how to keep them from cheating. We, we're that's a whole different show. We'll, we'll do that show. You know, maybe you can join me on that show. We'll talk about, you know, the myths behind the sex and the cheating, because if he's going to cheat, he's going to cheat anyway. Uh, but, you know, let's let's get to the happy stuff. Um, you know, a after talking to you, we went on this search for the womanizer. Um, and unfortunately my wholesaler doesn't sell it so i was like bent out of shape so you and i need to talk about that on the side <laughs> because i definitely wanna I, I definitely wanna um introduce that to some of the clients because you spoke so highly of it but first you know i have to try it you know i gotta speak about what i know <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's like, that's a, oh my God toy, <laughs> you know, like you want to scream, oh my God. Mm 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, my assistant was looking for it and we, like I said, it was just like, almost virtually impossible to get it. So hopefully, you know, the wholesalers will pick up on it and then they will offer it to us so that we can then sell it out to, you know, our clients. Because right now, like, yeah. Oh, uh, hi, Hope. I, I, there's people commenting. Guys, if I missed your comments, I apologize in advance. Hi, Raul. Hi, Nicole. And Warren, I know that you were watching last week and I wasn't able to answer any of your questions. So I truly apologize. If you guys have questions for Crystal, please feel free to go ahead, jump up, and I'll grab a few of these questions so that we can give it to her. I know Evelyn commented. Um, a woman of size is always in my movie. Oh, nice. Hi, Helen. You, so did you hear that? So they may not be on the screen. She's saying that there's one in her home every day. So um, I, I really want to know more about the um, curvy girl. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice. And, and, you know, we're grateful that you're able to do that because you're right. Why, why go to a size eight? Because you're right. People of size eight can find lingerie anywhere. I totally agree with you. I totally agree that what you're doing is just super amazing for the bigger women. You know, Yeah, and that flows. So Hope is asking, you know, um, what our topic is tonight, and Nicole is asking who I'm chatting with. So guys, if you want to move over to the YouTube channel, you can see Crystal live with me. We are on Monica S. Martinez TV on Google Hangouts YouTube. So feel free to jump over there from Facebook, guys, if um, you can't see Crystal or you can't hear her. Crystal is the owner of Curvy girl lingerie and her facebook page is curvy girl okay curvy girl inc on facebook and curvy girl lingerie on instagram was that or on instagram okay so guys um definitely check crystal out and jump over if you can come over to um, YouTube from Facebook Live, pretty please, because we were having issues with Crystal on the live channel there on Facebook. So I guess this is going to be an alternating thing where we go from Facebook to YouTube. It sucks. Let me just tell you that because the clients don't know where to go. So, Crystal, I want to I wanna have a little bit of fun with you because Tantalizing Productions, we offer this thing called the Tri-Monthly Club, and um, we, we talk about happy comings. So, oh, thank you, Dillis, for coming. 
So yeah, we just had some t-shirts made and um, they're awesome. So let me just show you them really quickly. So you see that? Happy coming. Guys, so check that out. We have t-shirts. We have them in white, black, and pink. And look what I also did. We did the panel. Isn't that cute? So guys, if you're, you know, if you are interested in getting this, feel free to, this is the tank top. Feel free to um, hit me up via Facebook. Um, Crystal, are you offering like any promotional things? You have any events coming up that we want to tell? That Okay, great. Thank you. So guys, if you heard that, Crystal is going to create a 20% coupon um, for us and you can shop with her, Curvy Girl Inc. And yeah, show her some love, ladies. I want you to stay with me. And that's, that's awesome because it's also like a support group as well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Give us an example of some of the questions that they are asking you. And that, you know, that's pretty awesome. I mean, and it breaks my heart to hear that women don't love themselves either. Um, because then we have, we have, you know, a generation of women who, who settle for things that they don't have to settle for. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Well, I think that's that's just the misconception in this business that we are in because, you know, I mean, hello. 
people are, you know, have that misconception about Monica. You know, this is what she does. So she must be a freak. She'd be willing, you know, to do whatever and with whoever. And no, that's not the case. Sorry. Mm. Very picky. Very picky. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Right. I mean, that's what it's supposed to be. But, you know, a lot of people are superficial. So, of course, you know, they'll go by the standards of, you know, what what the right size woman is supposed to be. And uh, it's a joke because that's that's not the reality reality of it. I mean, here we, we live in a generation where, you know, the women are fixing themselves to look a certain way, you know. Absolutely. I, I, I agree with you. Um, you know, listen, I, I'm okay with women doing, you know, plastic surgery to a certain extent, you know, um, but it's getting to the point where, yeah, we're going to have people that look exactly alike at some point. It's there's not going to be anything different. <laughs> Right. No, I, I mean, I get it. But let's, let's, let's just bring up the notch and just be a little more happier. I want I want to, you know, talk about like all the fun stuff that you, you know, you do for your clients. And, you know, I want to hear some of the stories about what, what happens when someone walks into your facility. And, you know, I want to know the energy. I want to know the energy level when it when that takes place. Mm -hmm. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> exactly to each his own <laughs> mm -hmm. And that's awesome. Um, yeah, I have a clientele where, you know, they 
just go ahead and they just give you all this information that's going on in their lives. And, you know, mm -hmm. you, you try to guide them through it all. And, you know, as long as, like you said, as long as there's consent, as long as there's protection involved and it doesn't involve children or animals, cool. do what you want, do it with who you will. Um, you know, as long as you maintain, you know, a level of respect and you love yourself, then I mean, it is what it is, right? So, <laughs> nice, very nice. Might have to come visit. I might have to come visit. <laughs> Ooh. Excellent. I mean, I'm, I might have to come visit. I'm, I'm thinking maybe, you know, just to do some research. Yeah, that is cool. So do you have any fetishes? Yeah, that is pretty awesome. <laughs> Yeah, well, talking about that, you know, I have to do the shoe of the day. I am a shoe lover. So, um, yeah, we have to do the shoe of the day. But before I do the shoe of the day, let, let everyone know where they can reach you, where they can find you. Excellent. Um, that is like an awesome movement. And Crystal, I, I apologize again for having to push the interview over back to YouTube as opposed to being on Facebook Live. I mean, at, at, at some point, we'll get it together and figure out which is really the better of the two. If it's not one acting up, it's the other. And unfortunately, you know, we have to move around like this and we're kind of rolling with the punches. So I definitely enjoy your, your energy and I thank you, you know, for coming on again and giving giving us you. Oh yes, I'm gonna do the shoot of the day. Let's see if we can handle this. Let's see. All right. Ooh, I have to I have to move everything and then I have to move the computer. So let's see. Just let's see if we can do this, guys. All right, can you see them? <laughs> Aren't they adorable? So, yeah, so that's the shoe of the day. I don't want to go too fast because then I got to hear mouths about how I didn't stay long on the shoe. It was too quick. Could you see the colors in the shoe, Crystal? Yeah, it's um, a gold heel and it's red, black, and white strappy. Can you see that? Thank you.
Yeah, I know. I I remember doing uh, an expo um, here in New York when the sex expo came. I think it, it had been a while before it was here and then it showed up here. And I went and I had a booth and I remember, I, you know, cause I'm, I'm a heel girl. So um, I remember a guy coming over and he was just like, oh, you have the most beautiful feet in the world. And I was just like, okay, thank you. <laughs> and, um, and then he was like, would you mind if I touch them? And I'm like, you're a stranger. You were not touching me. At first I thought it was like, well, what the hell is this? You know, but um, once you get introduced to it correctly, it's like the best thing on earth. So yeah, guys, if you have a foot fetish, definitely check out Monica S. Martinez. We do the shoe of the day. I love showing my feet. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I, I, you know, uh, whatever. <laughs> I, I really appreciate you coming on, but don't go nowhere because you know we want to talk. I want to see if you got some of these items that I want to talk to um, our clients about. So the first one I'm gonna put on is called the massage glove. Let me know if you guys carry that. That's the buku. Can you see that? Yeah. And can you hear it, guys? Can you hear that vibration? So do you carry this? OK, so this actually, it, it's great. It is like the best thing for um, a nice massage. And you can do this in the water because it's waterproof. It's great for doggy style because, you know, he can grab your hair and then he can come around in the front with the glove and, you know, take that down and visit places because it sends off 100,000 different stimulants. So, guys, check that out. Tantalizing Productions, check it out. So, are you into whips, Crystal? Uh, oh, okay. the, oh, like these? Hold on. You like these? I feel like these sting just a little bit. Just, I mean, just a nice little sting. But, but these are great. Oh, yeah, that's actually really good, too, guys. So check that out. We, we have those. Crystal has those. Uh, do you have those? Yes. Yes. OK. But my favorite is going to be the butter leather. Because this, it's soft, so it doesn't, you know, sting as much. So I, I'm sure you guys can't obviously see how light this is but this is one of the um toys that i got in uh where was this canada um the sex show in canada have you been have you been to any of those shows <laughs> oh okay because you don't even visit exotica when it goes to california oh yeah it's awesome i mean i go when I can, I haven't in a couple of years because I've been just dealing with other stuff. But we have so many amazing toys. So, you know, we educate women on all of this stuff. But again, if you could just tell everybody where they can find you and then I'll, I'll let you go ahead and, you know. Thank you. Nice. Nice. So we have, thank you so much for coming back on with us and stuff. So everybody is still saying hello to you. So um, they're really happy that you showed up here. So I, I want to thank you for, you know, joining us and, you know, just spending time with us again. And we would love 
for you to come back when when we really get all of this situated, uh, whether we're going to be on. Yeah, you know, we we tested this, and then the thing with the Facebook is that you, in order for you to test it, um, you have to sign on to that link and whatnot. But we, it's just been everything if it, it, it it's just annoying it's becoming annoying because i'm not sure where we're going to be what you know where we're going and stuff like that so mm -hmm. Absolutely. And I think that um, I think we can go live on Facebook without be live. And I think I'm almost positive. I read that somewhere where you can go live and then tap on, like, say, if you you showed up, I can tap on to your picture and then we can have the side by side broadcast. So I'm going to check into that. <laughs> Yeah, I think I think I read something up on that and I'm going to look into that too or have Dillis, um, you know, how about looking for that. But we appreciate your time and everything. So thank you for coming. You too and have happy comings always. Thank you. Have a good night, Crystal. Guys, I want to thank you for joining us again on um, Facebook Live and YouTube Live. And I'm sorry that we had to move things over yet again due to technical difficulties. But I have both, both options here. We have the Facebook Live running and I have the Facebook, I mean, Facebook and YouTube running at the same time. So... I just want to say thank you. Thank you for your support and join us again. We're here every Tuesday at 8.30 p.m. And next week we will be on Facebook Live. We're going to figure this out. DeAndre, I'm sorry I didn't say hi to you or Patricia. Hello. I apologize for that because these comments are coming in and I can't see them and stay on the YouTube knowing what's going on on both ends here so again we apologize for the issues that we are having tonight so thank you for joining us and a quick shout out to taino inc again once again for making our t-shirts the tantalizing productions happy comings because we're all about happy comings and making sure that people leave with a smile and yes he made some panties so we'll show you that again and we'll show you that. So thank you guys. Vessels, get sex wasted. Bye.